If you're struggling to get a band eight on your IELTS listening test, then check out this video for a really helpful tip. When I'm coaching our students, I always talk to them about the Uber strategy. When you order an Uber on your app, you're always told three things, the color of the car, the make and model of the vehicle and the license plate. That way you're prepared and you know what you should be looking for. So when you step outside, you don't waste time looking and staring at every single car that goes by. Instead, you hunt for and you focus on the exact car that you're looking for. Now on your IELTS listening test, before each section, you will be given one minute to read the questions. This time is super important and a lot of candidates kind of waste it, they breeze through it and they don't take advantage of it. So what should you do and how can you apply the Uber strategy to your IELTS listening test? Well, in that one minute, you wanna make sure that you identify all of the key words in the question. That way your brain is ready to look for and listen for exactly the information that you need for your response. If you don't take advantage of that one minute, it's gonna be really hard for you to listen for the response. Now keep in mind that the audio passage will not have the exact same word as the key words in the question. That's why it's even more important for you to be aware of the keywords so that you can hear synonyms in the audios. Aside from identifying the keywords in the question, you also want to ask yourself what type of information is missing. This will help you be prepared when the audio passage starts. So ask yourself the following questions. Is it the name of a place that's missing? Could it be a verb, an adjective? Is it the name of a person or a year? What type of information is missing? Some great ways that you can guess that is by looking at the context. What words come before the blank? Is there an article like a or the, or is there a preposition or a verb or an adjective? Really try and guess what type of information is missing before you start listening. If you like the Uber strategy and you think you can apply it on your next exam, leave a comment below and share this with a friend who needs a CLB9 on their IELTS test.